In today's video, we are gonna change it up. We're gonna do something completely different, but I really think this is going to add so much value for your nail business. We're gonna talk color combos, something that's really simple, but super key to your nail business right now. I'm really excited about this because Tracy is gonna walk us through five looks, okay, that are exceptional color combinations. This is something that every nail pro has to get down, I believe, to have like just a really solid career because ultimately what your clients are walking out the door with is color. And if you can get down the color combo game, you're gonna be in really good shape. Tracy really is a color expert. I don't like to compliment her that often, but this one time I will. I will say that you're good with color. I'm not comfortable with this. <laughs> it's kind of weird, right? It's a little weird. Um, she's. This, a, I would say that you're an expert in color. Well, like she's really good. I think this is a something that you and I actually share in common. We both love color. color. Yeah, and I would say I'm a striving, working hard towards recognizing color combos, and I have I have a passion for it. I genuinely love it. Tracy's really good. So uh, this is kind of her wheelhouse, I would say, when it comes to our brand and what we do at Young Nails and the stuff she does at Fenty. It's really about color first and foremost, right? Absolutely. Okay, cool. Let's dive into this. We're gonna show you some examples of great color combinations, why they're good. Let's start with the first set. Okay, first set, Tracy, by our amazing mentor, Monica Fenn, who always does great work. What do you see here? Well, first of all, killer shape. Yeah, but yeah, beautiful. Really simple, really basic color combo, right? It's in the purple family. Right. You know, purple's gonna match purple. Um, one has a shimmer, metallic look, the other one's a cream. But beautiful look, very simple to do. Right. If, if you can do these kind of things, I mean, it, it sounds stupid. It, it sounds so simple, two colors, but it's art. It is art, and here's the thing. Like, your client is not gonna lose walking out with this color combination. They're gonna walk out with a gorgeous set, a gorgeous color look, period. And here's the thing too, like, you could go all of the traditional purple in one accent of the glitter, um, I'm sorry, of the, um, what is that? So this color is... <laughs> Help! <laughs> this is uh, way above average. Okay. Um, but it's a uh, um, metallic. metallic. Thank you. That's mm -hmm. what I was looking for. So I mean, you could change it up. You could you could use it as an accent. Here she went. She went two Z's, three Z's, right? She went three of the regular perp, I am and going, then uh, stop. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Why do we abbreviate everything? <laughs> Can't help it. It's the SoCal in me. Um, but this is I love it because it is simple. Everybody can do it. Short, long, doesn't matter. You can go to town. I'm gonna tell you this look right here will get way more compliments usually people going i love your nails than just a high art nail right it, it's crazy right it's simple it's clean it's sophisticated um it's just easy to love it packs a punch it packs a punch i love it cool next next our our next set of nails is by our swedish distributor natalie cohen she just consistently pumps out gorgeous sets of nails. Her shaping is unbelievable, but more than that, she always picks great color combinations. Let's talk through this one. It's kind of similar to the previous set, yes. right? Yep. Um, but what do you love about this so much, this color combo? So you're kind of diving out a little bit more, right? You're, you're not going so like purple on purple. This, you know, you got your pink tone and then you're starting to venture into a pink purple. Right. They work because they're still in the same family range. Right, right. So you're not going so, it's like you're starting to pull apart a little bit, a little starting bit. to edge on the different color families, Yes. right? And you can do that and they still work because they're still in the family, as you said. And it worked, as you can see, it works beautifully. But right. Again, it just 
it's, it's, it's gorgeous. This is a great look too for someone that is one of your conservative clients. Sure. But they want to get a little wild. This is this is wild for some people. Sure, like sure. Like, Ooh, throw a little iridescent glitter on there and wow. Yeah, ab no, no. <laughs> and you could do that. You could take this, you could throw a little iridescent and then all well, of a sudden it's going to pop, right? Like she did here, right? Right. A little flash and burn. Again, same nude range. Right. But throw a little dash of flash and burn on it. Why this is so important is when you're first starting, how do you set yourself apart? Right. Right. You got tons of people doing art. Maybe you're not so confident in art like I was. I wasn't confident in art. But if you can do beautiful color combinations yeah. and you put it out like, here's my holiday looks, five, six of them. Right. And you got something like that. And you got that purple set from Monica. People will pick them all yeah. day long. I think that's a great piece of advice. You have these looks. I mean, take them here, show them on an iPad to your clients, here are some color combinations I'm offering. They're gonna die. They're, who's not gonna look at these and go, oh my God, I, I want this color combination. I would pick that, and, and this is just me, over like this iridescent, sure. beautiful, love sure. it. Yeah. But that's gonna go with everything. Yeah, it is. And I just like that theory of like, you can go, like we started with Monica's on the purple, on purple, but you can start to push the edges of the, the color families yeah but that'll apply across the board with any of them, yep. correct? Yeah, and, and super cool. play with it. Like yeah. if you're not sure of a color combo, while well, you have some downtime, get some display tips, start painting out colors, and then I, you'll see me do that when we're doing the Fenty thing. Right. Um, I yeah, will, you do it I've, I'll paint all yeah. displays and I start moving different tips with different things to, right. to get the color combos. Of course, of course. So, Gorgeous. What's next? Let's, so we have went. Okay. I think this is my favorite. This is what started this conversation. It did. It did. The reason why we made this video is because we pulled this nail look up and I was completely blown away. Again, the the nail art in itself, it's very simple, right? Stunning. But the combination of color here is, it's so insanely gorgeous. I can't even handle it. This is another person, Dawn. Yeah, she's who nails ridiculous. nails color combos every time yeah like just and she steps out of the box right she's not afraid to step it and like, she has and she like has right, right here. here exactly talk talk through this trace what do we have so this is going to be push your push the envelope and late bloomer now maybe not so much two colors you would necessarily put together right, right. you have kind of this metallic tone with push your envelope it's a, kind of a glitter but it has this metallic look to right, it right right then you have this cream this kind of a blue gray dark mm. gray Beautiful, both so beautiful. amazing for fall. How does you combine those two worlds? Yeah. She put this bronze gold glitter. So good. Made the accent nail with gold and bronze. It ties everything in together. But even if you take this one nail out of the gold and bronze, yeah. and you just have these two, it works. It totally works. Because of that little hint of bronze and gold. Right, so she pulls in an accent and now she's able to just draw in a whole nother color this this blue gray color that's just going to work with the entire thing because you have that one thread that's linking this accent uh marble gold uh nail yep. with the push the envelope as well yep right so it's kind of like a she's bridging it she's yep. bridging all these colors it together all just start comes everything Super kind creative. of all by itself you're like what you start tying it in it yeah. just works my favorite, I think my favorite set of nails, just with this color combination, I've seen in a very, very long time. It's so stunning, so unique, it's so creative. I would say you should probably check out Dawn's look if you wanna see like interesting color combinations, go to her page, check them out. Use it for inspiration for your nail game. Yeah. Um, what else do we got? So I really wanna talk about this one. Of yeah. Nats because another another one of Nat's sets of nails. Yeah. What I love about this, it is screams holiday. Yep. It screams it without being a stinking pumpkin. On <laughs> right. It's not literal. It's like, not right. literal, and right. that is, you know me. I do not like literal literal holiday looks. Yeah. I just don't. Yeah. So something like this. Even if you change this up to a red nail or a green nail, yeah. you can be into the Christmas season. Or, okay, you did this for Halloween, which has passed, right. but it still works for Thanksgiving because it's the, the orange. It's beautiful. You, you drop that black down, 
right? It almost becomes foundation. You can almost drop any color. The orange off that black just pops like no other, right? It does. And that's what black does. It, this is like, I will beat you after Thanksgiving dinner. <laughs> so fierce it is, is fierce. this set because of obviously the shaping is gorgeous, those stilettos, but that orange popping off that black, it's it's very intense in a positive way. You're gonna get lots of attention with this set of nails. There's no way around it. Yep. You're gonna get compliments. People are gonna, they're gonna see you from across the room. Yep. That orange popping off that black, they're gonna see you anywhere. <laughs> Absolutely. Right? And I think another reason I wanted to show this one is when in doubt, go black. Go black. Yeah, and it goes with everything. It does. It, and the thing is, is like during holiday, during winter, right, where you're gonna maybe, you can skew towards these like darker colors. You can use, I mean, use, I mean, you can really wear black anytime, but right now it's like, take advantage of it, right? Yeah. yeah. Black, drop another color in. Use it as accents like she did. Go one nail, go two nails. There's so many different ways you and can I, go. And I love, like, it's it's not matchy-matchy, right? Right, right, Even though right. it's only two colors, she used different colors on each finger. Each, each hand, right. Switch it up. Just I love that. I love that. And then I think... We got one more? The last one I want to go into is, this is a, a, a brand ambassador of ours. Okay. She does beautiful work. And I picked this one because by itself, that orange and burgundy brown for me don't work. Okay. It, they, it just, it's not a color, two colors I would put together. Then she goes and she puts this glitter. In between. And it just all goes, and that gold on the, uh, on the burgundy. Right. And all of a sudden, you just have this amazing color combo. The, the power of accenting mm -hmm. right uh bridging similar to what dawn did mm -hmm. in, in a way right using color using one glitter in this case the glitter is bridging the gap between these colors to make the set work yep. um it's incredibly like when i look at this i'm thinking as far as color is concerned it's like it, it just it works it feels right so simple color is but like that's not an easy thing to do to put this combination together right to know that that's going to bridge that orange and that burgundy but this is why you get on our page <laughs> and you, you take and it. you take it please that that's really yeah. that's what it's for like we've had people actually contact us and say one like she was colorblind remember yeah that? yes and i she, do you know she's like i can now provide great color combos for my customers amazing that is what we're here for and as you go, kind of like you, learning color, yeah. it's amazing how much, now you're like, that has a tinge of this, you're, I, and you're like dead on. I know, and and Tracy will ask me sometimes, she's like, well, what does this have? What does this skew more? Is it more blue? Is it more red? Is it... And I'm, I'm, I'm starting to see it with practice and, and shooting nails for the last three years and seeing the sets they do. But what I'm interested in today, if I was doing nails behind the chair, mm -hmm. I would go to our page, I would look at, all these color combinations i would take this episode right here that we're shooting and i would use it as a building block on my color game i would look for situations like dawn's and 77 nails here where i'm going to take maybe two colors that don't really work alone can i pull in a third that's going to bridge the gap start getting creative like that playing with stuff right that's fun yeah it, it really is yeah i enjoy it when i actually have not time. I never have time, but when I'm have to sit down and I got to figure out some looks, I, I just love painting out color and just moving them around and playing with it and see what works. Yeah. Take this episode as a way to improve your color game if you so need it, right? Like for me, as I said, I would take it, I would use it as a way to just help me guide my clients through color combinations. And the thing is, is that I know this when I walk in to like, in my case, get a haircut, when the hairstylist is like, this is the product you want with confidence and shows me and shows me images like this is what it, I'm in, give it to me, I'll buy it, right? If you show your clients these color combos with confidence on an iPad and you let them know, look, these are hot right now. You say it just like that. These are hot right now. You should really wear these. You're gonna get a lot of attention. What do you think they're gonna do? They're gonna wear these looks. Sold. Sold. And it's a great way to just get your color game to the next level. Agree? Absolutely. 
awesome. Tracy, thank you for walking us through all these beautiful looks. I really love this episode. It's fun. I want to do more of these. With you? With me. <laughs> with me or Greg? You. Perfect. And with that, <laughs> we're going to get out of here. <laughs> thank you for joining us. We'll see you next time.